guys. Um, real quick, right off the bat, hopefully these type of videos will be a little better. I have a new camera. Hopefully that camera has a little better audio quality. Um, I've never been one to uh, use a corded mic when filming off the bike, and uh, I think I looked one time for like a Bluetooth uh, mic to work with my phone, and I couldn't really find anything. So hopefully it's better than it was. Um, so anyway, uh, subscribers were closely, I think we're like 278, so we're real, getting real close, approaching the 300 mark, which is fantastic. I really appreciate that. I don't put a huge amount of time into my videos, especially from the editing side. It's more just, you know, maybe one day when I'm older, I'll be able to look back on it. And then, you know, I went ahead and made those videos public. People kind of liked them, a few people here and there. But the channel's definitely changed a lot. Uh, like I said, the content, I don't do a whole lot of time editing. I'd rather spend my free time writing. So with that in mind, uh, the content for my channel's never been anything special. So if you enjoy it, and you subscribe, I sure appreciate it. If you enjoy it and you're not subscribed, subscribe. Because I do have something special planned when we hit 300. I have a special ride planned. Um, I don't think I've ever seen anyone do this exactly. I mean, it's no, it's nothing that crazy special, but I don't think I've ever seen this done the way I'm gonna do it. Um, it's kind of a, uh, you, you'll understand what happens. There's a novelty piece that's sold for bikers, and it's a navigation piece, and I'm actually going to use that to navigate and film a video. It'll all make sense later. Um, <clears throat> so that's going to happen when we hit 300 subscribers, so hopefully sooner than later because it's getting cold outside. Um, it is currently Halloween 2020, so it's yeah, starting to get cold outside. Um, also, new bike. Uh, I can't do without the Deal Sport. The channel started as a Deal Sport channel. I've rode Deal Sports for years now. I've had plenty of cruisers. I've also had plenty of Deal Sports. Uh, five, I think, to be exact. Uh, DR200, KLX250, uh, DRZ400, KLR650. I'm maybe off by one. So, and I'm back. Uh, don't freak out if the camera moved just a little bit, but anyway, the wife and kids came home. Um, so back to it. Um, yeah, going back to the deal sport. Uh, I just can't stand on having one. The you know, right when I got this bike, I was pumping out videos kind of quick because I knew in a short amount of time I was going to run out of free time, and that's kind of happened now. Uh, but when I do have that free time, I want to be able to go off road. I just can't. I, I'm having a hard time doing without it. So uh, bolts going. Uh, that's kind of neither here nor there. I'm looking for DR650. That was what I wanted when I originally got the KLR650. So I'm just going to go DR650. Uh, the KLR was great. I'm definitely not going to remod an entire KLR after I just got rid of one. Um, that'd just be done to me. So I'm going to get the bike I originally wanted, which is a DR650. Um, what else? Uh, so that's going to happen in due time. It's not like it's had already happened or happening tomorrow. It, who knows how long it would take for that to happen. I've got to sell the bolt first. Uh, you'll see a Kawasaki Bayou 220 sitting here. That is my wife's. And yes, I sold the Zuma 50. I only had that thing for like a week uh, and it sold quick. So that's where I'm at now as far as vehicles. I might make a video on the Bayou, like take it and actually do some riding on it. Uh, let me know if you think that would be interesting to you. Um, I think that's it for the updates. You know, we're going to hit 300 subscribers. When we do, no matter what bike I have, I'm going to, I've got a video in mind I'm going to do. It'll be interesting, I hope. Uh, it'll be different for sure. And uh, yeah, that's, that's all I got for you today. So, fingers crossed, as soon as the bolt moves, uh, DR650. Unless something unforeseen happens, who knows? It is 2020, anything could happen. But yeah, I do like the bolt for what it is. If I could keep it and get a DR650 or another deal sport, I probably would. If I could keep it, I probably wouldn't get DR650. I don't know what I'd get, but it probably wouldn't be something that big. Um, but if I'm just gonna have one bike, it's gotta be a bigger thumper. I may wait and see what Kawasaki does next month. They're supposed to announce 
uh, two new dual sports. I'm hoping they just updated the KLX 250 to maybe a KLX 300 or 350. And then I'm hoping they re-release KLR. Depending on what they do, it might interest me. It might not. I don't know. We'll have to see. Um, but as far as the Gen 2 KLR, I will be getting another one of those. I think that's everything. So until next time, peace. You filthy animal.